piece of thick stuff right there. I came in one pathway. Oh, I'm sorry. I am at the site of a 2009 Bigfoot sighting here in West Central Florida. Um, I just came down at one pathway off of the main road and a kind of dead end, so I pushed my way through the thick forest. I don't know if you can see that through there. And I came out to what appears to be another pathway. It kind of looks kind of inviting that way. But what I want to do is head back this way because I think there might be a water source back that way. This is a pretty wild area. And I think when I do leave, I'm not going to go back the way I came, but I'm going to go back down this path up here. Okay, just as I thought, there is a remnant. Oh my god, I just hit the spider web. This thing's big. I don't know if you can see it. It's about three inches across, and I just crossed his web. Looks like a river or a creek or something. I imagine kids come back here. Like I said, it's not too far away from my subdivision. But what I'm looking for in the mud here is footprints because nobody in their right mind would come back here barefoot. I've lived in this area now for well over 30 years. And I never knew that this creek existed. People have come back here and dropped off their trash, but looks like it's been a long time ago. I'm not seeing any recent signs of people coming through here. There are no footprints other than my own. Freaking pigs. Why would they leave their trash out here? Holy crap. Looks like a tree house. Bigfoot built a tree house. <laughs> What have I stumbled upon? I think somebody's living out here. Hello? Hello? Is there anybody here? There's their fire pit. There's their living room. Is there anyone here?
bedroom. I wouldn't be surprised if that's where they slept. They stay off of the ground. That could be that path that I saw before. This path goes straight across this river. Hello? Okay. I guess if I was homeless and destitute, I'd resort to the same thing, but I'd like to think that I would make such a huge mess of this place. I'm going to cross over this creek here. It's be difficult to get down there today. I don't have much daylight left. I'm going to try to push down deep into the back here. See where it takes me. So I guess there is a possibility that the Bigfoot sighting could have been a homeless person living out here in the woods. Did I just debunk that sighting? I don't know. But you heard it here first on Enigmatic Anomalies. Everything doesn't have to be a Bigfoot.